Fuck you. Talking all that shit. Fucking knock your ass out. <laughs> Whoa. Was Oscar De La Hoya subbing Canelo with threats and warnings saying, I'll beat yo. Eh. We're about to talk about all that and more in this video. Stay tuned. What up, Fight World? It's your boy Ego, and I'm back with some more boxing. Make sure you smash the like button. Also, subscribe to my channel for the latest and greatest in boxing. Yo, if you love what I'm doing, smash the like button. I drop daily boxing content, all things boxing. This is your one stop shop. Boxing Ego, the future. If you like that kind of thing, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell notification for post notification so you don't miss anything. Now, you guys seen the clip at the beginning. Oscar De La Hoya, he was training. He said he was coming back July 3rd, but, you know, with not too much time, less than a month before, it's June 9th as of recording this video. I don't know. I don't know if that's the case because he hasn't confirmed an opponent. Now, they were trying to get George St. Pierre of UFC fame, but according to many reports, St. Pierre was not allowed to participate in a boxing event on Triller with Oscar De La Hoya. Maybe he has some kind of no non-compete clause or something since he retired from the UFC. I'm not sure exactly how they have jurisdiction over a retired fighter, but if I had to take a stab at it, there's probably some kind of clause in his contract that stipulates he's unable to compete with another, you know, combat organization for a period of time, something like that. Now, this was previously, it, Oscar didn't say a name. He didn't, I do believe, I do believe he makes a strong case. He didn't say Canelo's name, but there's been obvious friction with the two, Oscar De La Hoya and Canelo. Get the f out of here. It's my night. Going back and forth. As you guys see in this picture, on this Instagram page, they were going back and forth. Canelo responded. Oscar basically posted what you see on the screen. And it was a picture of Canelo like working with a kid and working on his boxing technique or whatever. Oscar De La Hoya had a lot to say. He says, please, this guy does everything wrong. His head up is his head is up when he throws his hooks. He's on his heels. He's flat footed. What else? Oh, he avoids twin Charlo. But I believe he meant to put um, Jamal Charlo. So he says he's ducking. He's avoiding Charlo. He's flat footed. He's on his heels. And if you look at that video at the beginning, he says, this is how you throw a shot balanced and, you know, precision and this and that. And he says, yeah, you keep talking ish. I'm coming for you. I'm <laughs> I'm going to knock you out. Canelo responded to what I just showed you. The first thing that De La Hoya said, where he's saying this guy does everything wrong and was criticizing it. You see, it says Canelo Roy roars, go F yourself to De La Hoya. And he put a bunch of utensils. And here's the post. I made a video about it. We did great numbers on the video. So appreciate everyone who listened to it. It says, please, this guy does everything wrong. Head up when he throws his hooks on his heels flat-footed what else oh yeah he he avoids charlo and then he said oh really you want me to talk you ucking traitor so he called him a traitor and then he says oscar de la hoya do me a favor and go uck yourself and then he put a bunch of like spoons and skillets and <laughs> hatchets and knives and stuff so i'm i'm assuming he's talking about like utensils because of uh, what two girls alleged that De La Hoya was into some freaky stuff and, you know, ran up on them with some utensils or whatever. So Canelo being a whole savage. And it's just, it's crazy. It went from sugar to ish. You know, De La Hoya 
some people are saying he's just angry and De La Hoya is um, pressed about it because Canelo is now a free agent. If you guys remember the end of last year, there was tension between Golden Boy and Canelo. Canelo included the zone, Golden Boy and Oscar in the lawsuit. And based on Canelo having the case, Canelo was able to become a free agent getting out of his contract with Golden Boy and his own. And now he has the ability to move about more freely. And he just completely cut Oscar and Golden Boy off and cut them out the equation. So whatever split in money generated, knowing Canelo's a, a star, you know, whatever money that he was making for Canelo for Ganello, um, make it for Golden Boy. That's no longer the case. And Canelo seems to be pretty happy. And you, you see him no golfing, no life. He just got married. You know what I mean? He just beat Billy Joe Saunders' eye into submission and retired. Oh, I can't say retired, but um, retired him on the stool at, at the very least. And he looks, he looks to be happy. You know what I mean? He looks happy with life. And he made that change and Oscar De La Hoya looks bitter and angry and salty with him. That Morton salt, you know, Canelo out here. Look at him with his wifey. So I don't know, man, this whole situation getting ugly. I don't know about Canelo and Oscar fighting. Listen, that would have been a badass fight in their prime if somehow we could see it. But obviously Oscar came from a different generation. So he had to fight Mexican legends like Julio Cesar Chavez. Now, you can say what you want about Oscar, but you you can't deny he's a great fighter when his career was on, and he's an Olympic gold medalist, and he fought everybody. So him critiquing Canelo about his style, I mean, it's not like some just like arm armchair critic. This is a guy who's a gold medalist and who did it, and, you know, it would have been classic to see them fighting the prime. Now, Oscar... You know what I mean? He's he's had struggles with whatever, depression or drug use or whatever. So I, I doubt the fight will happen. I don't even know if Canelo would allow Oscar De La Hoya to get that type of a bag by even working with him. You know, Canelo, he seems to be kind of a traditionalist. If you listen to him talk about um, like Mayweather and Jake Paul and fights like that, he doesn't seem as keen. So I doubt he would fight Oscar De La Hoya. But I don't know. I don't know how it happened logistically. But who knows? When you piss somebody off and Canelo got youth, maybe he would try to, you know, take it there to to get that off his chest. This is Oscar De La Hoya and Canelo. I was born ready in happier times. And it's just it's getting crazy. So, I, I mean, I don't know. I don't know what's up with De La Hoya and um, Canelo. It just... Oh, media's in shambles. What what do you want me to say? You know, they they used to seem pretty cool, but that's clearly not the case now. Again, Oscar De La Hoya, he didn't officially say Canelo's name, but it did sound like he was subbing him, and that's what a lot of people are reporting it as. So let me know what you guys think. Drop your thoughts in the comment section. Also, use my link to get TubeBuddy. Listen, if you're a content creator, Regardless of what your channel is about, you can make money on this platform like yours truly. I've been using TubeBuddy. It's a browser extension to help you level up your content, make more money in YouTube, in turn doing that by optimizing your videos. A ton of features packed in to make life easier and more simplistic as a content creator. So give it a swing. Give it a shot. Use my link in the description and get TubeBuddy. Oscar. You know, they definitely ain't smiling towards each other now. And I don't know. Uh, it'll be interesting to see what happens next. See if Oscar is coming out of retirement. See if Canelo responds again. Things like that. Canelo's pretty mature. So I don't know how if fans are expecting this collision back and forth. I, I don't know because Canelo, he kind of bites his tongue and he's he's winning. You know, life seems to be going fairly well for him or real good you know you're making money fighting overmatch guys and doing this austin powers european tour fighting um you know the people who he's been fighting caleb smith and turkish fighters and saunders so we'll see how it all plays out drop your thoughts in the comment section subscribe as always hate comment and subscribe to next videos ego son and all